Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be going over how to do multiple looks inside of ProPresenter 7. So you could have different looks depending on if you want to have your worship look like this or then and then your words for speaking or messages, whatever, could be something a little bit different. This would be good for if you're doing the live stream and or the speaking, you could have them all kind of be a little bit different depending on your screen setups. So let's get started. So first thing you want to do is open up ProPresenter and then you're going to want to edit your theme. So go into theme editor. Right now I have two different themes set up. So I have one where the words are bolded, one where they're not. And then I have two different lower thirds set up as well. So we have one where it's all caps, one where it's lowercase. Once you get that set up, you can go ahead and make sure, make sure it's saved in your own preset or if you're using one of the other presets, it's up to you. But after that, you're going to go up to screens go to edit looks and then in here where this is where we had the looks from before for the other lower thirds video that we had the initial setup of it and then in here we have two different look presets so we have default and then we have live I'm just going to use the default and live you can go ahead and hit plus here if you want to make something special for more specific to what you're doing all you have to do is inside of live you're going to, want to go ahead and make sure you go into your preset and then select the one that you want to have live for that. Same with the words for the main. So we have our so we have a side screen and a main screen. So I'm going to go ahead and make both of those the same. So we're going to do the um, the bolded ones for this one for live. And then on the default one, we're going to go ahead and do the opposite. So we're going to have on here the non bolded and the non bolded. And then same for the um, the lower thirds then we're going to have on the other one because Wirecast is our live stream. And then from here, you're going to go ahead and want to, whatever you want your main overall default to be, make sure you have that one set as make live. And then you can exit out of that. You can go to your show. So then what you want to do is you want to come over. So we'll start off in the message notes here where we have some verses. So we want to right click that one. We want to go to add action, audience look, and then we're going to set this one to the live version which then when we click that, you'll see over here in Wirecast, it changes it like that. If we go to main screen, it looks like that. Okay. And then if we go over to the song, right click that, go in there, go default. And then once you click on this slide, that will trigger the default. And you see now they're not bolded. And then if we come over here into Wirecast, you'll see it's capital, all caps. So you can go ahead and change, change the looks to however you want to look, but that's pretty much all you gotta do. Nice and simple. And then it will keep this until you re-trigger it. So you only have to trigger it on the very first song. And then after that, you don't have to re-trigger this again. Same with the same with on here. So now that I triggered it here, I could go into a song and it will keep it just like that until you go and you trigger the look again. And then once you trigger the look, then it will do the same thing again. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, be sure to give it a like. Leave a comment down below on any questions or anything else you might need help on. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And we'll see you next time.